Today, we're cooking a very simple salad with a very nuanced dressing, and we're serving it with silken tofu. It's delicious. What do we have here? Two bell peppers, a cucumber, and a carrot. She's been lying around in the fridge for quite a while and she looks lonely and bored. We could just wash them, clean them, peel them, chop them, and eat them, but we could make a fantastic salad with the most amazing dressing, add some protein, and just make it like, make it a really proper meal. As you can see, I've added a few ingredients, but trust me, we need each and every single one, and it's gonna make, I mean, we're gonna have a party today. Let's talk about the sauce. So we're traveling to Asia. This is gonna be like, a, like an umami, soya, sesame oil situation. Uh, and for protein, and we're using silken and smooth tofu. I love this stuff. You know why? Because it's, like a readily, quickly available, incredible source of protein. So it's high in protein, high in calcium, very low in fat and in calories. And it's just a really fast way um, to pack a meal with nutrition. So this, and with this sauce, it's amazing. Because tofu has like a bad rep because it's very neutral in taste. I would even say bland. But this one has a really nice, like soft and smooth texture. And with the dressing, mm, it's gonna be perfect. So the plan, we're gonna, we're gonna prep the veg, we're gonna make the sauce, and then we're gonna introduce the two. And it's gonna be a party. I mean, I promise you, a party is gonna be a party. I'm gonna start with my green onion. I literally found a piece lying around in my fridge. So we're gonna chop this up quite finely. I'm gonna use my leftover chili. With chilies, I think you know that like after even touching it, always wash your hands and never like rub your eyes or something. Um, and if you want it to be less hot and spicy, just remove and throw away, like discard the seeds. But I'm gonna add both the skin, the red flesh and the seeds today. With the garlic, I'm gonna, I'm gonna use a, a garlic thingy and, and, and insert baby garlic in there. I have no idea what it's called, but it's like a special machine that you like, you put the garlic in and then you squeeze it and it comes out. But you can chop it, dice it, whatever. You could also add some ginger. That'll be nice. Just like some freshly grated ginger, but I don't have any lying around, so we're gonna go with this. I think I forgot to mention some of the ingredients. So besides soy sauce, uh, I'm using rice vinegar. It's, it's delicious. If you don't have rice vinegar, go with, I don't know, apple cider vinegar or any other, but this guy is delicious. And toasted sesame oil. This is a game changer and a deal breaker. Please don't skip this step. Uh, and a little bit of sugar, just to kind of bring it all together. And it does add like a necessary balance with like the, the fattiness and the heat and like the umami taste. You don't wanna use sugar, just like use a tad of like honey or maple syrup or any kind of sweetener. Uh, we're gonna let the dressing sit. And I always make a little bit more dressing than I need today. I keep it in the fridge. It lasts perfectly for like a few days. And it just goes well with everything, literally everything.
This is a, a flavor bomb, which is actually, it makes no sense. You know, cucumbers, you know, they're bland. Tofu, quite bland, but this is a flavor bomb. And I'll explain why. The chili, the green onion, the sesame oil, toasted, it all comes together into a beautiful, beautiful, flavorful dish. I garnished it with this thing called, let me tell you, it says something in German, but I think it's called furikake. It's basically different kinds of sesame seeds and some, mm, some seaweed, like some crunchy nori. It's really, really good. Mm, if you wanted to add some more body to make this like a complete, like very fulfilling meal, you could add some rice noodles or some ramen or some like soba noodles, just cold. Mix them into the salad and then dress them up with the tofu and the sauce. But this is just divine. I'm gonna be eating this all summer long. You have the fiber, you have the protein, and then you have the fats, and it's just, it's just delightful. And silken tofu is such a blessing. I mean, look at it, it's so creamy. I actually love to use it in dressings uh, instead of like a mayo. And it adds a lot of richness and creaminess without the extra calories, the unnecessary ones. To you guys, see you soon.